Although facing so many setbacks, Microsoft still grows stronger. Once upon a time, in the vast and ever-changing realm of technology, there was a powerful company named Microsoft. Founded by Bill Gates and Paul Allen, the ambitious duo had a dream of placing a computer on every desk and in every home. Over the years, their dream turned into reality, as Microsoft emerged as a dominant force in the world of technology. With the iconic Windows operating system under their banner, the company became synonymous with personal computing. But the world of technology was ever-evolving, and Microsoft would face numerous challenges on their path to becoming one of the first few companies to achieve a $2 trillion market valuation. This is the story of their successes and failures, and the power of perseverance. In the early days of the mobile revolution, Microsoft attempted to stake their claim in the emerging market. They released Windows CE, a mobile operating system designed to compete with Google's Android and Apple's iOS. Despite their best efforts, Windows CE was ultimately defeated by the ever-growing popularity of their rivals. Android's open-source nature and flexibility attracted a multitude of manufacturers, while Apple's iOS, with its sleek design and seamless integration with the company's hardware, captivated consumers. Around the same time, Apple introduced the world to the iPad, a tablet that would redefine personal computing. The iPad's sleek design, intuitive interface, and large library of apps allowed it to outsell traditional computers on a yearly basis, leaving Microsoft's attempts to compete in the tablet market floundering. They launched the Surface tablet, but it struggled to gain traction in the face of Apple's dominance. Microsoft's struggles were not limited to the mobile and tablet markets. At the height of its power, Microsoft's Internet Explorer dominated the world of web browsers, commanding a staggering 95% market share in 2002. However, as new, more innovative browsers like Google Chrome and Mozilla Firefox emerged, Internet Explorer's market share began to dwindle. By 2015, the once mighty browser had been reduced to a marginal player, further emphasizing the challenges faced by Microsoft. During this time of turmoil, a new leader emerged at the helm of Microsoft. In 2014, Satya Nadella, a visionary who had risen through the ranks of the company, took on the role of CEO. Nadella understood that the future of Microsoft lay not in direct competition with their adversaries, but in the power of innovation and the pursuit of new horizons. Nadella knew that the cloud was the future, and he made it his mission to transform Microsoft into a cloud-first company. With the rise of Azure, Microsoft's cloud computing platform, the company began to regain its footing. Azure enabled businesses to build, deploy, and manage applications through Microsoft's global network of data centers, making it a powerful tool in a world increasingly reliant on the cloud. But Nadella wasn't done yet. He believed that the next frontier was artificial intelligence, AI, and that by embracing AI, Microsoft could once again revolutionize the world of technology. He forged a partnership with OpenAI, one of the most prestigious AI research organizations in the world. Together, they spent four years developing ChatGPT, an AI-driven language model that would transform the way people interacted with technology. The introduction of ChatGPT was groundbreaking. It allowed users to have natural, human-like conversations with machines, opening up a world of possibilities for both personal and professional applications. But Microsoft didn't stop there. They integrated AI across all their product lines, enhancing user productivity and offering cutting-edge solutions that enabled them to stand out in the tech world. One example of their AI-driven innovation was the integration of AI into Office 365, their popular suite of productivity tools. Microsoft introduced new features like Ideas, which provided intelligent suggestions to help users create better content, and Presenter Coach in PowerPoint, which used AI to provide real-time feedback on presentation skills. These enhancements demonstrated Microsoft's commitment to using AI to improve users' experiences across their products. Meanwhile, Microsoft continued to make bold moves to ensure their success. Recognizing that the value of their platform lay not in the operating system itself, but in the myriad of services and applications they could offer their customers, they made the decision to give Windows away for free. This strategy allowed them to reach a broader audience and fueled the growth of their ecosystem, as more users meant more demand for Microsoft's suite of services and applications. In addition to cloud computing and AI, 
Microsoft understood the importance of gaming as a key growth area. They invested heavily in their Xbox gaming platform, acquiring numerous game development studios to expand their library of exclusive titles. They also launched the Xbox Game Pass, a subscription service that provided users access to a vast library of games, further cementing their position in the gaming industry. Under Nadella's leadership, Microsoft also turned its attention to the lucrative enterprise market. They developed Microsoft Dynamics 365, a suite of business applications that combined CRM and ERP capabilities with AI-driven insights, enabling companies to make data-driven decisions and streamline their operations. Microsoft Teams, a collaboration and communication platform, was introduced as well, allowing businesses to stay connected and productive in an increasingly remote work environment. Not content to rest on their laurels, Microsoft also ventured into the world of mixed reality with the development of the HoloLens, an innovative headset that blended virtual and physical worlds. This technology offered new possibilities for industries such as healthcare, manufacturing, and education, showcasing Microsoft's commitment to exploring new frontiers in technology. As Microsoft continued to innovate and expand its product portfolio, the company's market valuation began to soar. Their cloud-first strategy proved fruitful, as Azure's growth continued to outpace competitors, capturing a significant share of the cloud market. AI-driven products and services, gaming investments, enterprise solutions, and their foray into mixed reality all contributed to Microsoft's resurgence in the tech world. And so, in the face of great adversity, Microsoft demonstrated that resilience and adaptability are the keys to success. Their story serves as a testament to the importance of learning from failure, embracing change, and pushing the boundaries of innovation in the ever-evolving landscape of technology. The once mighty giant, thought to be on the verge of decline, rose like a phoenix from the ashes, achieving the staggering milestone of a $2 trillion market valuation. Through this incredible journey, Microsoft proved that a company's story is never truly over. By embracing new technologies, seeking out new frontiers, and never giving up in the face of adversity, Microsoft not only survived but thrived, becoming an even stronger force in the realm of technology. Their story serves as a powerful reminder that even the most successful companies must continuously evolve and adapt to maintain their place at the top. And with this spirit of innovation and determination, Microsoft's future looks brighter than ever, poised to continue writing new chapters in their remarkable tale of perseverance and success. As the tale of Microsoft's rise to a $2 trillion market valuation continued, the company realized the importance of strategic acquisitions to consolidate and broaden its product line. Microsoft embarked on a series of bold moves that would further cement their position in the technology world and diversify their offerings. In 2016, Microsoft made a landmark acquisition of LinkedIn, the world's largest professional networking site, for a staggering $26.2 billion. This acquisition not only expanded Microsoft's reach into the professional networking space but also allowed the company to integrate LinkedIn's wealth of data and resources into its existing suite of products and services. The combination of LinkedIn's professional network with Microsoft's productivity tools created a powerful synergy, offering users an all-encompassing solution for managing their professional lives. Another significant acquisition came in 2014, when Microsoft acquired Mojang, the creators of the wildly popular game Minecraft, for $2.5 billion. This move not only bolstered Microsoft's gaming portfolio but also brought with it an engaged and passionate community of players. Minecraft's sandbox-style gameplay and emphasis on creativity resonated with millions of players worldwide, making it an essential addition to Microsoft's gaming lineup. By bringing Minecraft under the Microsoft umbrella, the company demonstrated its commitment to expanding its presence in the gaming industry. With an eye toward the future, rumors circulated about a possible acquisition of Blizzard Entertainment, the gaming giant behind titles such as World of Warcraft, Overwatch, and Diablo. While not yet confirmed, such a move would further consolidate Microsoft's position in the gaming world, adding to their growing roster of game development studios and exclusive titles. These strategic acquisitions, along with Microsoft's continued emphasis on innovation and diversification, played a crucial role in the company's resurgence. By carefully selecting and integrating new assets into their existing product lineup, 
Microsoft was able to strengthen their position in key markets and explore new opportunities for growth. The story of Microsoft serves as a powerful reminder that even the most successful companies must continuously evolve and adapt to maintain their place at the top. Through strategic acquisitions, innovation, and the perseverance to overcome adversity, Microsoft not only survived but thrived, becoming an even stronger force in the realm of technology. And with this spirit of innovation and determination, Microsoft's future looks brighter than ever, poised to continue writing new chapters in their remarkable tale of perseverance and success. As Microsoft forged its path toward a $2 trillion market valuation, one critical factor that played a significant role in the company's resurgence was its transition to a software-as-a-service (SaaS) business model. By shifting its focus to subscription-based services, Microsoft was able to tap into new revenue streams, create stable cash flows, and foster long-term customer relationships. In this in-depth analysis, we will explore the impact of the SaaS model on Microsoft's financials and how it contributed to the company's growth and revitalization. A recurring revenue and stable cash flows. The SaaS model relies on subscription-based pricing, which ensures a steady stream of revenue for Microsoft. Customers pay a recurring fee to access Microsoft's software and services, creating predictable and stable cash flows for the company. This reliable income allows Microsoft to invest in innovation, R&D, and expansion with greater confidence and reduced risk. B. Customer retention and lifetime value. The SaaS model fosters long-term customer relationships by encouraging users to remain within the Microsoft ecosystem. As customers become more invested in Microsoft's products and services, they are more likely to continue using them, resulting in increased customer retention and lifetime value. Additionally, the SaaS model enables Microsoft to regularly update and improve its products, ensuring that customers always have access to the latest features and functionality, further solidifying their loyalty to the brand. See Scalability and Flexibility the SaaS model enables Microsoft to scale its offerings more efficiently, as the cloud-based infrastructure can be easily adjusted to accommodate fluctuations in demand. This scalability reduces the cost and complexity of maintaining and upgrading on-premise software installations, allowing Microsoft to focus on enhancing its product line and expanding its customer base. Additionally, the SaaS model provides customers with the flexibility to adjust their subscription plans as their needs change making Microsoft's products more appealing and accessible to a wider range of users. D. Cross-selling opportunities. As Microsoft's SaaS offerings continue to grow, the company can take advantage of cross-selling opportunities by promoting its suite of products and services to existing customers. For example, a business using Office 365 may also be interested in adopting Microsoft Dynamics 365 or Azure services, increasing the customer's overall spend and contributing to Microsoft's financial growth. E. Enhanced competitive position. By adopting the SaaS model, Microsoft was able to better compete with other technology giants, such as Google and Amazon, who had already embraced cloud-based, subscription-driven services. This shift allowed Microsoft to remain relevant and attractive to customers, while simultaneously tapping into new markets and opportunities. Some notable examples of Microsoft's successful SaaS offerings include Office 365, Microsoft Dynamics 365, and Microsoft Azure. Office 365, a cloud-based version of Microsoft's popular productivity suite, allowed users to access essential tools like Word, Excel, and PowerPoint from any device. While Dynamics 365 combined CRM and ERP capabilities with AI-driven insights to help businesses make data-driven decisions. Microsoft Azure, the company's cloud computing platform, provided a wide range of cloud services, allowing businesses to build, deploy, and manage applications in Microsoft's global network of data centers. In conclusion, Microsoft's transition to a SaaS business model played a crucial role in the company's financial growth and overall resurgence. By embracing the SaaS model, Microsoft was able to generate recurring revenue, foster customer loyalty, scale its offerings more efficiently, capitalize on cross-selling opportunities, and enhance its competitive position in the technology landscape. This strategic shift not only contributed to Microsoft's financial success, 
but also enabled the company to continue innovating and growing stronger in the face of ever-changing market conditions.